Hello gamers, Lomax here with you from Let's Play Games Kentucky. Uh, today we're going to be looking at the Warhammer Quest Silver Tower. We're going to dig in and look at all those minis and the boards. So let's just jump right to it. Let's go ahead and take this plastic off. I know this may be a little late, but I just want to get a video out there of this for you. I'm going to try to break this up into a few parts, looking at the minis and then the board and all the other components. So, go ahead and get some of this out of the way. Here we have our heroes and looks like the big ogreoid monster. First one we'll try to look at. Here. The first one looks like we have is the Excelsior War Priest. You can see that card there. Here's the miniature itself. Comes packed tightly in this little sprue. Looks pretty. Looks like a GW new miniature. Very nicely detailed, done, made. There's not a lot of room for options. There you go. And that's the War Priest. Next up. Looks like we're going to have the Knight Questorus. Just give you a little picture of the card and the mini. Get that in there. And looks like we have the Dark Oath Chieftain also. Get you a look at that. Can't see it very well. Get you a look at the back of it. And then the next one. It's the Ogroid Thaumaturge. Ever hate that? Sorry. Uh, he comes on two sprues. Looks to be a pretty beastly of a miniature. Let's see if I can't zoom in. There you go. Try to look at that. In the front and the back. Up close views of the sprue. Next one we have is the Fire Slayer Doom Seeker. Pull that out a little bit. I'm just going to go ahead and show you these with the card. Yep. Next one for you is the Tenebrail Shard. That miniature and the card. And the last hero miniature it looks to be the Mist Weaver Psy. Here's that sprue plus the card. Mm 
Looks like we have the Gaunt Summoner. Gotta go ahead. There's a picture of the Gaunt Summoner sprue. I don't know if that's new pose or anything from the uh, Gaunt Summoner that came out a little while back. There. And for the rest of it, the rest of the creatures, the pink horrors, the blue horrors, the, I think it's the Zangors, all of that comes on two sprues. I'll lay that down here and see if I can't get a little closer look for you. There's the first one. Looks like a lot of these do go together one way. So, not a lot of multi pose. It's all one way. I guess that's what you get for $150 with a lot of miniatures. Here's the second sprue. Here's the back and the front and again they all look to be pretty much one pose miniatures here's a quick shot of the familiars or there's one familiar there's some of the goblins all right in the next episode, we're going to look at the components that come with the board game itself. So, if you would like, hit the subscribe button and tune in for part two. Thanks.